What is up? I'm just making sure. Oh, <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Um, just kind of making sure that I do have a mic. There we go. Sweet. So basically, um, and I hope that you guys can hear me. Um, how to fix your Xbox not running tools like it should. Um, you do have to have certain plugins, and I'm actually going to right now as we speak um, make a plugin pack. Um, let's see here. RGH tool. Um, let's see here. I'm just going to call it plugin pack because that's all I can really think of it. And what's happening is a lot of consoles aren't updated like they should be to files out R17502 dashboard. Um, here's what I have for mine, which I'm going to open up neighborhood right quick. There is my JTAG. Um, we're going to go to my HDD. Um, I like to go to my other one if I can. Um, I can't get to it, so we're going to go here. We're going to take launch INI. I'm going to drag it here. Now, ignore what this says because it's going to say copy and replace. Um, we're going to replace that launch INI, and I'm going to open it up in, in, in uh, Notepad right quick. And I will show you guys why it does what it does. Um, it's not that hard. It's just kind of a dumb thing um, that happens. So here's what my plugins are. Um, you guys can use whatever you want to. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and say forget that plugin. The first thing you're gonna want is XBDM and then your server, whatever server it may be. Um, and then the last three are gonna be XRPC, JRPC, and XDRPC, because that is an updated version of this, and then XRPC is something else. So I'm thinking this is all the same, and I'm not gonna say that for sure. But I have my bottom three plugins set as this, and I don't have to worry about anything. Now, I will say this though. Now I can actually hit like X Notify. This is the X Notify tool. Um, it's going to load. X, you can see X Notify tool. Um, I'm going to hit Connect. You see that I did connect. And then from there, I'm going to type in uh, SWAT Mods YouTube Help Video. And then I can literally hit push notify, and now I see it on my console. So, but yeah, it, it's working now. It's not going to give you guys um, any, what is it called, uh, errors. Because whenever I want to use recovery tools all the time, what would happen is I would get um, things like in Crimson V8, um, XRPC, and XRPC updated is uh, XDRPC. And I'm going to load Crimson Mods V8 really quickly. Um, here it is. This is the tool. Um, I got a call. So I'm just going to kind of also sub to his channel. He's really good. I'm going to end because sorry if I'm in a video. Um, but you have all of this stuff here. And it works. Like you can see I can hit force host if I wanted to right now. Which I don't because it will freeze my console because I'm not on Black Ops 2. But it does say connected. So I'm going to hit force host. Okay, that time it's because I'm not in the game. I'm going to hit continue. But if I was on Black Ops 2, I would go through. Um, I'm not scamming. I'm not... Oh, my God. I'm going to give you a freaking KV here in two minutes. Um, but, yeah, that's just about it, really. Um, if you guys want an actual how to set this up and how to make sure your tools are running and how to clear 99% of the problems, I will do that. Oh, my God. I don't care. Um, but, yeah. So... I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go, and this is my video, and I will see you guys probably in the next one. I will make this as a download. It will be a RAR file, so you will need to extract that. Um, other than that, guys, this should probably work, and if you have any other questions, just let me know, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.